animals here, including these fish behind me, I'm here for one animal in particular, tarantulas. Ooh, gotcha. I don't know this one though. Okay, y'all ready? It's time to touch the tarantula. I don't know if I have a fear per se. I mean, I think they're kind of cool, but I know you guys are afraid of them. So let's try to face our fears together, okay? And boom, just like that, we were friends. Okay. Professional Wrangler. <laughs> I hire you for the movies now. Hello. Okay, where are you going? Come over here. Oh, I got this down pat. Okay, let's talk to the man who really knows what he's talking about. So this tarantula is the size of a dinner plate. Isn't she beautiful? He or she, I really don't know. We don't know. No, we don't know. <laughs> How can you tell, typically? Well, the from, the si female? from the size back here, but it's more of a comparison. Gotcha. She's a uh, three, three, four years old, and she'll keep growing. And how long do they typically live? Females can live up to 20 years. What about males? It sounds like they live as long. Uh, seven. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Y'all got it rough. And how many, how many different types of um, species of tarantulas are there? There's hundreds of them. Wow. And they're all safe. None of them could hurt a human. You hear that? You're just scared for nothing. Tran spiders, <laughs> yes. Tarantulas, no. See, spiders, yes. But everybody just calls them big spiders. That's the misconception. Well, Hollywood doesn't help. Yeah. <laughs> every, every spider you see in the Hollywood movie is a tarantula. Because nobody will be afraid of spiders, so they have to get the big ones that look scary. Mm -hmm. But they're really sweet, you guys. They really are. Somebody's not going to believe me. Um, why do you think people are afraid of, of spiders or tarantulas? Like, where do you think that fear comes from? I, you know what? I don't know. You want to say the movies? Uh, just something with eight legs on it. Most people are used to having seen two or four, not eight. <laughs> and they're becoming like, a, I, feel, I feel like they're becoming popular pets. The animal store sells a fair number of them. And how? Um, it's small, easy to take care of. Yeah. Feed it once a, you know, once a day, a little cricket. They yeah. usually eat a mouse. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. So are they good? Are they like, um, I don't want to say family pets, but like, do you think kids like them? I go to parties that I do have an animal show and the eight, nine year olds, seven year olds, they're playing with them. <laughs> cool. It's cheaper to keep than a dog. <laughs> <laughs> and it'll scare all your burglars away. <laughs> so. Are they typically like just kept in their cages or can you like? Yeah, yeah. when you're not handling it, I would keep it in the cage. Um, you don't want to step on it <laughs> walking right. around the house. Right. And how does their body like, can they, um, like if you dropped it by accident? They're pretty sensitive. If, if this part could, the back of it could uh, crush, they, if they drop, they can die. And are they harmful to other pets like dogs and cats? No. No? No. They're fine. You just got a bad rep. Yeah, you got right. a bad rep. It's not you, it's them. He's going back in his little home. It's, it's home. We're going to let you go back home. Just like that. And then just give a little push, a little Come tap. On. Oh! Because I'm home, I'm away from her. <laughs> this is pretty cool, guys. It's pretty cool. If you want to face your fears, come to the animal store. Come to the animal store. It's really not that bad, I'm trying to tell you. Wait, y'all thought it was over? No, no, uh uh. Wanna kick it with me? Hit that subscribe button and you won't miss 